exciting beginning to a truly exciting episode. Truly. That's the name of my friend's dog. Time to start finishing off the egg, the egg quest. Because I think that's the only part we got left in Dairy Dactyl Land that we can do at the moment. And because Kazooie came back flip, you gotta figure out something else for that part. Where I can't think of anything better than than the usual alternative that I have. Find a high spot and jump from there! I mean, that's the pretty normal way of handling it. Totally normal. Once I figure out where the platform is. Okay, down there. There's probably easier ways to get to this egg, but this is the the way I know of to grab it. Also, first and beforehand as well. If I remember correctly, we have an Something to get over here-ish. Let's switch the grenades before I can try doing that again. Because there is a switch right here. Which I somehow hit that time! Don't ask me how, I just did. And if you do it correctly, no, no, no! I wanted to leave first person, not bash my head into a wall. What's the difference? Well, you did both, almost. Anyway, there's the third egg, and there is one more left. Is it said that you do have to land to be able to hatch the egg? You do? You do? You mean I have to land on something to sit on it? Oh! What an inconvenience. Can't believe this. Anyway, one final egg to go grab. One last egg. The egg of finality. <laughs> in the cave. But it might not be in the cave. It might be on the other side of the cave. We're just going in the cave. Cave. Jump. Get stuck on wall. Okay, I need Banjo and Kazooie for this. You need help. Go to therapy, like Sora lying on a couch. His therapist is dead. <laughs> Take this medication. Side effects include dark side. <laughs> side effects include a, a, a bizarrely realistic looking dark side. I am afraid. He picked up my car. I don't want to have guessed there was a Superman villain. <laughs> no, I-D-E, not E-I-D. Honestly, I'm still like 100% convinced that it is Darkseid, because he doesn't have the face tentacles. Who's that wearing those silly shoes? Who are you wearing those silly shoes? Ha! Well, I really hate your silly shoes, but we really like our silly shoes. Please stop wearing those silly shoes. We want to stop wearing our silly shoes. They're just shoes, man. Why are you turning into Frozen? <laughs> well, then to respect your silly shoes. Respect for me so that we won't lose. Please stop. I'm going to try to pay your silly shoes. Man, quit talking about those silly shoes. Anyway, the last egg. It's hidden all the way over here. Yeah, 
All right. Can't even fly. Hmm. I don't, I'm not sure if there'll be room in our nest. But you couldn't just hit it with one of those grenade eggs. You heartless. Only joke. Bring it, bring it back and I'll work out an exercise program for her. I was gonna find Banjo Land. Man, I was just yeah, born and I'm already fat. <laughs> Damn metabolism. She, she, she's, not, she's not really overweight, she's just large, like physically large. He's no, roasting Banjo is not the solution to your problems. Banjo has the solution to your problems. <laughs> Shove it in the back! I shall call you Nebby. <laughs> so what happens if you try to if you try to join up with Kazooie again while you have something in the bag? Ah, uh, you're not able to. It's just no. There's no room in the end. No, you just. I don't think she says anything. You're just not able to. She just stands there. Uh, <laughs> Actually, comment on that. I have nothing to say to you, you idiot. Anyway, anyway, the bur anyway, the I'm sure the baby's fine <laughs> with all the shaking happening in the bag. She's an unbearable pain. Nothing you lose weight, right? Yeah, but just shake the baby. Then I'll lose weight. <laughs> The baby's in unbearable pain. Ha! <laughs> Do you like my joke, Senpai? Not yeah, I liked anymore. it as much. I liked it as much as I like you. Not at all. <laughs> Thank goodness, Kazooie won't want to see another egg for for the rest of the game. Well, too bad! Too bad. Here's the other half of your reward, as promised. And now, it is time for Joel, Nathan, and Damien critique cuteness. Uh... What? What a B-plus cuteness. Or are we comparing the two of them? No, just cuteness. It's like a B plus. Uh, It'd be I, better I, with I, an I think easy. Like it just kind of down and downgrades it just a little for me. Would be better with an oh, easy. No, 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 yeah, no, would be better with a newsy, you're right. It's always better with a newsy. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Banjo is too depre too depressed that he didn't have a newsy. And and because and because I did that, we can we split right back up and and can immediately join up with Kazooie again. Anyway, it's time to go back and finish a lot of worlds. So what we're about to do is the as the backtracking episode that right? Or yeah, we'll mostly. Yeah, most of this episode will be the re getting the rest of the G's that we can get now. Murder one more dinosaur for good measure. Especially this isn't going to be the uh, only backtracking episode, but it's going to be the first, one of the first main... Oh, I never got the Drabble Clef! <laughs> I guess we'll have to come back and grab that Get the tra later. Yeah, get yeah, the tra okay, travel tough. He's looking at the guidebook. He's probably going to get it now. Okay, it's not that hard. I was making sure that it was in a place that we can't get to. We're fine to grab it now, actually. It's just a bit out of the way, so it's not <laughs> that surprising that I didn't grab it. So I'm starting to notice that at least in this area, a lot of the ledges, you need to jump out from a distance or you get caught under them. Yep. Hooray! Video games. It's not video games, it's realism. Uh... 
Yes, I too, I too bonk my head on the edges of ledges that I'm trying to jump up them, because I can jump that high. Yeah! Don't you? Uh, I can't jump that high. Well, then maybe we should put you in an exercise <laughs> regimen, then. Jumping six feet in the five six feet in the air is really hard. I don't even have a pole to do it like Olympics people do. Anyway, I believe you need to fly to this one. And there's the last of the notes. Six hundred. And that finishes up Pterodactyl Land as much as we can complete at the moment. I That's mean, I, I suppose you can pop, maybe fly into the drippy pond to get the p page, but it's not that worth it. <laughs> oh man, that would be awful. I mean, I suppose you could do it, but I don't want to. But you, might, you might as well just wait till we can actually do the drifty bond properly. Yeah. I don't even know what the next sheet is, and I just don't think it's anything extremely useful for us. I don't remember. Anyway, time to go for, for finish stuff. You finally go finish Glare to Gold's mine. I don't know exactly which one it was we couldn't get, but we can definitely get it now. Well, this is the wrong place. Oh. I'm thinking of the other location. I believe it's the crushing shed that I want. The crushing shed! Yep. Go to the crushing shed! Up the hill! There's nothing up there. This because this is where the boots are. You get the boots. And then you jump real high. And then you get, you get 48. And I Those believe that's Glitter Gold's mine fully completed. It's a, it's a, it's a... Yep! Jig, not a ginger. So an hour and six minutes in Glitter Gold's mine. My M Temple was 55 minutes, if anyone's wondering. You, 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 you. And I don't know if we can finish, and I don't know if we can finish Witchy World yet, but that's... Uh, yes we can, actually. That's where we're heading next. You can't actually fully finish it? I was wondering if there was well, anything we, else Well, we, we still need to get there. something from Witchy World, but we can actually complete the totals, I believe. If okay. I remember correctly, the, of what we have left in Witchy World. Oh yeah, you need more abilities, so you, at least so you can steal the junk from there. Yeah, you need the junk food from there for the Oogle Boogles, but we don't have the power-up necessary for that quite yet. Well, we can go pick up a fat kid! How did he get so fat anyway? Because of burgers. Oh, oh that must, must be the key. That must be the key. The key, the key, the key who, who was bringing me? Who, 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 who I, I was about to make a horror go with joke, but then I realized it didn't make sense. Is that, is that one fucking McDonald's that keeps showing up where someone brought, brought McDonald's to their mouth? Like, who the fuck does that? It's, it's so trashy. Who? To what? It's not so uh, you know, like a potluck, but like a whole family, like a whole get together where everyone brings their own food. Oh, okay. So about, about like, going, bringing McDonald's to a potluck, it's like, that's so trashy. You also don't to bring your own food. Anyway, we fit the fat kid into the backpack and then bring him to his mom. <laughs> yeah, bringing McDonald's to a potluck, pretty sus. Damn millennials. Saying sus instead of suspicious. I mean, you're older than you. Can't just say the regular word. Oh. 
damn youngins and their millennials. I'm pretty sure Sauce would mostly be a Gen Z thing. Tell you about not I'm sorry, ma'am. Sorry isn't good enough, young man. You've been eating again, haven't you? Well, you'd still better watch your dinner. It was that strange bear, Mom. He made me eat this burger. Enough of your lies. Oh gosh, you beat all the food out of him. Well, I think we've all had enough excitement today. Time to go back home to Hailfire Peaks. A lot of people are wondering where we've gone to. Eat better atlas to get rid of the oven. Bye then. Thanks again, Banjo. Take this jiggy I found in the ticket office earlier. Just don't look at it, maybe it'll go away. There, see him on the way. 49. And that's Wiki World fully completed in an hour and 18. You should get a beating before you leave. Fine, we'll go see, see Madam Gruntilda before we leave then. <laughs> You got a second cheat! <laughs> no, there's no second cheat. <laughs> you win a beating! I like this one! <laughs> Where is Tootie? <laughs> Madam Grunty's tent is closed temporarily for refurbishment. I need to order more beatings! <laughs> you need to order more beatings. You need to order more beating sticks. I need a new belt. A new purse! I learned it from Mrs. Boggy. Yep, we still can't glide. I think that'd be a pretty basic thing to know, uh, you know how to do if you have wings. How does a bird like, not know how to learn? Well, reminder that, because we needed to learn how to fly last game. And also need to learn how to hatch eggs in this game, so... Speaking of... You have, I mean, note that... You have learned how to sing. I mean, she's still... She still can't fly whenever she wants, and fun fact, Spyro couldn't fly whenever he wanted until 2008. <laughs> and then he forgot again. <laughs> well, I guess he can learn how to do Wait, that. Wait! Uh, something more God! Oh no, he's upside down! And then he's tipped up. That's not funny. Please help him! option here. Obviously, grenades solve all problems. Yep! Oh, that's much better! I found this buried in the sand. It's yours. Now come along, son. I'll take you to meet all your sisters. Your 19 sisters. <laughs> I, I, I can't get that a weird and probably a pretty rough childhood. Yeah, I had three older sisters. And look at me, him, I'm fine! If this is Kingdom Hearts, it would have shown him going all the way to his sisters. <laughs> they would have been modeled at everything. 
Yep, we still got two jiggies to find in Jolly Rogers and, and they'd a, 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 a honeycomb piece and a, and a note. And then they'd have a and then they'd have some mystery and then they'd introduce some mysterious characters who they wouldn't explain for another three games. <laughs> Who's secretly the villain? <laughs> You see, that's when we would find Kazooie and Klungo's love child. Ah, <laughs> uh, right, alright, I forgot, I, for, I forgot about the plot of Banjo 3. Banjo, Banjo, Banjo 4. Banjo 4 is when they made it official. That's when, they, that's when they actually made, they actually made both uh, Banjo and Kazooie's marriage and uh, Kazooie and Klongo's marriage canon, right? Sure! Man, why do I not remember what world's next? <coughs> yeah, I'm sure it will be a fun and pleasant experience. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. It's fine. Maybe, yeah, I think they'll, I think they'll be fine. You have, you have, you have your friends. Your friends will help you. <laughs> my friends are my power, and I'm theirs! <laughs> but I said that with Sora's oh, voice, but I said the Ventus quote. I didn't realize that was a side piece. <laughs> Behold the power of the mighty Toasty Woasty. <laughs> Is that me? Giggity giggity. Am I Toasty Woasty? Cause I am a toaster? And the final section of the hub world. The Quagmire. Giggity. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, I was about to say, I was gonna let you, I was gonna let, let one of you guys make the joke for me. Uh, I don't know what the joke is. Well, Damien probably knows. Yeah, because I made it. Giggity. I assume this is a joke that goes over my head that I don't want to know. It's family guy. <laughs> okay. I probably don't care then. <laughs> yeah, you probably don't. We just remember the blue man group who was hiding out on that roof. He must I'm be trying to remember how to get the blue man group. <laughs> I remember how to get He's over to. blue! Just like Noah V'ger! Oh, I love that Star Trek character. 
<laughs> it's really funny because the, because Noah Vedra's player is a huge Star Trek fan. Oh. It's fake. It's fake! It's not Noah Vedra at all! I thought they had Noah Vedra in this game. We got revenge. I sure did. You're not a you're not a real you're not a real uh arrogant assy. Time to burn. It's time to burn. Empty in dust pies. Next time on Banjo Tooie, we begin what is what is many people's worst level of the whole game. Bye-bye.